channel. If you're new to the channel, then hi guys, my name is Rashmi and I upload new videos every week. So if you like what you see so far, then make sure you subscribe to my channel. So talking about today's video, it's going to be really interesting because I'm going to be talking about my top 5 nude lipsticks which are under 200 rupees. I am a total nude lip lover. I love wearing nude lipsticks. Uh, that is something which I go for like every day. I'm not at all a red lip person. I love wearing my nudes in pinks. So all of the lipsticks are for you and me which means the Indian skin tones. So without any further ado, let's just begin with today's video. So just while filming the video, I got this idea that whenever I'm going to talk about a particular shade, I'm going to wear that on my lips. So yeah, moving on to the first lipstick, I think this is the one which I'm going to talk about. This is from Savannah. It is the Savannah Soft Matte Lip Cream. Now I have them in two colors, like two shades. Both of these are nudes. So the one which I'm wearing right now on my lips is more to the brown side. It's a perfect, complete brown nude for the Indian skin tone. I think it's going to suit a lot of skin tones. And yeah, this is the first one. Now talking about the second one, it kind of washes me out. So what I do is I like to apply a lip liner beneath and then I top it off with this one so that it gives a really nice shade. Now talking about the formula, I think it's really, really uh, matte. It's quite drying. Uh, and also whenever I've noticed, whenever I wear this lipstick and eat or drink something, it starts getting crumbly and you know, it just fades out automatically. I don't know what it is. So I just make sure whenever I am not going to eat or drink anything I wear this otherwise I don't go for it because it just fades and it just crumbles up which I hate about it. Now another thing which is a really big problem with the lip creams are that they don't have any shade on them. It's really confusing. I mean I don't even know how I'm going to show you guys that you know which one to buy and all. I can only put like a really nice swatch so that you know you can take a screenshot and then buy it. Now the price is also quite cheap and uh, looking at the packaging it's so tiny. It can fit in your pocket in your purse like anywhere. I really like the packaging. So yes these were the first lipsticks. Now the second lipstick which I have on my lips is this one. Uh, this one is my favorite out of all. This one is the perfect nude because it has a nice brownie and uh, you know pinky undertone. I don't know how to explain it but the color is so pretty. It's a nice uh, pinky nude or you can say a brownie nude which will suit every other Indian skin tone and I think this one is my absolute favorite. This one's from Kiss Beauty and it says that it's the Kiss Beauty magic lip gloss but uh, this is not a lip gloss guys. It's a matte lipstick and I love the formulation. It also says it has vitamin C and everything. I'm in the shade 7 and I think the bottle and everything is quite huge so you can use it like it's not gonna get over really soon. One thing I like about this one is that the packaging, uh, this one is quite similar to the Jeffree Star lipsticks. I really don't know but yeah. It also smells like watermelon, you know we used to get those boomers but when we used to eat uh, boomer aata tha jisme, uh, watermelon hota tha. it smells exactly like that. So now you know why you should get this one and yes this is the second lip color. third lipstick which you can see on my lips is this one. This is a lip crayon and it is from the brand called Me Now. I bought this online from Shop Clues. I would leave a link in the description box below in case you want to buy this. And as you can see this lip color is the perfect nude. I mean you can see it how it is complementing the dark cold eyes and you know it's looking so good. I think it will look so good if you do smoky eyes and something like that. And so I would definitely wear something like this on this kind of makeup. This is something I would go for. It is amazing. They are also called the kiss proof soft lipstick which means they are kiss proof. The only problem with them are that they are in a powder matte form which means uh, it is really powdery and really matte. In case you have super dry lips make sure you use a nice layer of lip balm beneath because that is what I do because I have really dry lips. It's quite uh, travel friendly because you can take it in your pocket, in your bag anywhere it's really nice the packaging is good and it looks really bomb so yes this is the third one so the fourth lipstick which you can see on my lips is from none other than mister 
I think this one has a nice pink undertone to it. It has the perfect pink undertone. So if you're someone who loves nudes with pinks, like your new color with a pink tint, I think this one is something to go for. I think this is a perfect lipstick for the no makeup makeup look. Uh, whenever I don't feel like wearing any makeup, I go with this one. It gives the illusion of, you know, my lips but better. So this is the fourth lipstick. Now the last and fifth lipstick which you can see on my lips is this one. This is from a, a brand called Seven Heavens. It's a really nice drugstore brand which is available almost everywhere. This new color is actually very special to me because this was one of the first lipsticks which I was introduced to, like the nude lipsticks. So I still remember I was in junior college and I used to wear this like every day. It was my go-to nude. I just got to know about nude lipsticks and everything. And I used to wear it every day because I used to love the way it used to look on me. It is not a pinky nude, not a brownie nude. It is a mix of both of them I think. So this one is quite cheap as well and I think it's a nice lipstick. It's, it's not like a matte lipstick. It's a not like you know a gloss lipstick. It's something like semi matte you can say. So yes this was my last and fifth lipstick. Well thank you so much guys for watching the video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed the video. And next time I'll see you guys in my next video. Till then you guys take care of yourself and I'll see you guys super soon. Bye.